Lovers and haters of Ross Seller, this is Ross Seller. Obviously, I look like I just woke up, of course, because I just had a dream about a bunch of dead believers of the Abrahamic faiths, right? Okay, and I've been having these dreams frequently, okay? In my last video, talking about that, that you know, Ronnie, main nut guy, I had mentioned that I had dream, dream about dead Muslims, right? I had, I had mentioned that they were like, Where's my reward, right? Where's my reward? Because, you know, and I said, hey, don't bother me. Take it up with this. Take it up with this. This doesn't promise you that you could get 72 versions and all that. Don't, don't bother me with that. I never promised you. I never promised you anything, okay? These, these books are, are, and now, recently, I just had a bunch of dead Christians. Dead Christians coming after me, Tom Sum, where's my reward? Where's my reward? And then, you know, they want to get violent with me because, you know, see this? And I got plenty of Bibles, okay? Okay. I even got this one right here, okay? Okay. They say, where, where are my, where's Pearly Gates? Where, where, you know, where's my reward? Where's my master's rest? Okay. There's a lot of dead Abrahamic believers, Christian, Muslim, whatever, Jehovah Witness, um, Catholic. There's so many dead Isbis out there because they had thought that when they died, they were going to go to heaven. They were going to get, you know, 72 virgins. They were going to get whatever, okay? They thought they were going to get it. And, you know, I've been practicing lucid dreaming. I've been practicing, you know, coming out of the body without dying. I've been, I've been practicing that. And when they see my spiritual energy, they just come straight straight for me. And they don't, they don't want to get violent with me saying, we're, 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 and I said, look, I didn't, I didn't promise you anything. Okay. I didn't promise you anything. Don't come after me after you don't live your life, after you done, you know, did whatever off for your religion and all that stuff. And now that you're not, you don't have a flesh body anymore. You know, you want to come after people that are practicing how to how to come out of the body. Don't don't do that. Why do you think I'm making these videos right now? Tell tell everybody that that hey, this world's a prison. You know, these Abrahamic religions are lies. They're all lies. Okay, they they they're not gonna bless you, no matter what you do. You could do all the religious rituals. You know, you could you could go hunt down all the non-believers all you want. And all that stuff, but they're not going to bless you. I, I'm trying to get that in your head. You know, with the Jesus character, there are so many inconsistencies with this man. You know, and I'm trying to tell you all that he's not coming back. He's not real. He's fiction. Okay. You know, with the Muhammad character, you know, horses don't fly. This is it. Horses don't fly. I never seen a flying horse. I never seen a Pegasus. They don't fly. Just what it is, man. Okay, these Abrahamic religions are lies, and they're all based on the Torah, right? Now, alien interview already attacked the Torah. You know, Errol attacked the Torah; she just obliterated it. Okay, boy, I don't keep you keep it going. Talk some. Oh, Rod, you're you're full of it. You're gonna burn a lake. There's no lake of fire. There is no lake of fire. There's a bunch of. Let me tell you what's going on. There's a bunch of angry. Angry people who used to be alive, now they died, thinking that they were going to go to heaven or whatever. They used to be alive, they're no longer alive, and now they're very upset that their religion was not true. That they wasted their life on a lie. Atheists ain't so bad off. But these, rel these religious people, they are in the worst case scenario ever. And if y'all think the physical life is about to get really ugly and stuff... Just wait till after you die, okay? There's going to be so many angry people, so many people, you know, so much regret, okay? That, oh, I, I thought this lie, Whoa, what was I doing? And then, you know, you got some of these people demanding that they get their reward. And I'm like, look, I didn't promise you that. I didn't promise you that, you know? These people don't want to take responsibility. These people don't want to, they don't want, just no, they don't care. 
They just, they just, oh, I suffered so long. I, sh I deserve a reward. And they keep, they keep, you know, they keep it going. And I said, I never promised you that. Another thing, none of these books are available up there. Like, whatever knowledge you had gotten, you had to memorize it, okay? None of the books are up there. None of them, okay? I mean, there might be technology up there, but it's, it's like, you know, the, the energy, okay? If you see a, like a, a, a toy store, it, somebody created that toy store, okay? You see an amusement park, somebody created it, okay? But that's the thing with these, these, these Abraham believers, okay? They think after they get a certain, after they die, they, they, they deserve something. They deserve a reward or something like that. No. Whole thing's a lie. All of it's a lie. And of course, I'm going to do more videos, man. I'm going to do more videos. And I'm I, like I said, I ain't even mad I got fired. I'm not even upset that I got fired because, let me tell you something, I was working, I was cleaning a church. That's why I ain't mad. Okay? I got my hands on this. Okay? I ain't even mad that I got fired. I'm not, I'm not even regretting that I got fired, man. Like I said, Errol already destroyed the Torah. She destroyed it, okay? It's a bunch of lies. She read the Bible cover to cover. No question. She, she read it. She's been fighting with them directly, okay? Like I said... I'm gonna do more videos, man, cause cause there's so many inconsistencies, man. Too many inconsistencies. But y'all wanna get upset. Y'all wanna sit here and say, oh, you're gonna burn a lake of fire, right? There is no lake of fire. I'm serious. There is no lake of fire because lake of fire, just like an Ellie interview said, and, and I I didn't even need Ellie interview to figure out that you know stuff was from Egypt. And remember, Egypt is a facade civilization. Okay? Okay. Versat civilization. That's what this book say. Okay. Egypt, a facade civilization. All this stuff about oh, you're you're not an immortal spiritual being. You're just a flesh body. You know? that all came from Egypt. Okay. Priests telling you oh, you're just a flesh body, and after you die, you dead forever. And then what? After you, after the body dies, go into the light. Right. Go into the light. Get zapped billions of volts. Okay. But apparently, after Elliot Interview came out, their, their little light trick ain't working anymore. There are more people who die. They're, they're, they're understanding what's going on. They're understanding, but they don't want to accept it. They don't want to accept that the religions are a lie. They don't want to accept it. Okay. Just like today in this world, you know, y'all don't want to accept that it. it's, a, it's a depression. Y'all don't want to accept it. Y'all want to keep it going and say, oh, oh you swear for your poor, you're so negative, this and that, this and that. I want to be entertained, okay? Okay, y'all y'all don't want to accept it. Oh, yeah. But that's why I got to keep doing these videos, man, because y'all ain't for, I mean, if you think it's bad now, yeah. Because I mean, all these people expecting a reward, all these people, all these Abraham believers expecting a reward after they die. And then they come out the people who actually learn how to remote view. No, they learn how to come out the thing. Uh, yeah, and I'm learning how to do it. It's just I have to put my body to sleep, deep sleep. You know, I wish I could learn some techniques on how to do it frequently. So when I do die, it ain't no surprise. Anyway, that's all that's safe right now. More videos are coming. I will be talking about, you know, how these Abraham religions... They gave you false hope. Not only that, they support communism, spiritual communism, okay? They tell you, oh, you're not allowed to think for yourself. Oh, do not trust in your own understanding and all that nonsense, right? Now, I'm trying my best to tell you all that before you lose the body, man, you need to understand, this, they, they, they lying to you. They're not going to bless you, okay? They will not bless you, no matter what. You know, they go, you can pull all these verses and say, oh, God, it's not like a man that he'll lie. Oh, he, 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 he lie. He lie. I, I said multiple times, Yahweh already broke every, everything, okay, all the commandments. He, he's done every sin that you could think of, okay? And that alone should tell you that the blood, and besides, blood is a physical thing. 
Blood is a physical thing. How is a blood of a man going to pay for your mistakes? Blood's a physical thing. There's no such thing as spiritual blood. No such thing. There you go. There you go. But hey, let me go ahead and let y'all go. I'll see y'all later. Remember, Earth's a prison planet. There's no escape. That's why we got to start spreading this information everywhere. Peace.